Hi, hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Sri Lavanya, Certified Integrative Nutrition and Hormonal Health Coach, Internationally Certified Yoga Instructor. So in today's video, we are going to see certain rules and regulations regarding diet that you should follow to balance your hormones and to get pregnant as well. When it comes to hormones, you need to improve your chances of getting conceived by focusing on a quality diet. So that quality diet depends upon the hormones in every phase because we are not like men we women we have a complete shift over of hormones from one phase to another so according to that particular hormone if you are nourishing your body this might even increase the process of getting conceived fertility is being highly influenced by age your lifestyle as well as your environment and the products that you are using the dress that you are wearing so you need to be very careful in each and every aspect that you are changing phase wise diet in that the number one phase is menstrual phase where you are bleeding it's where the uterine lining gets shed off so you will be losing a lot of blood so to support that you need to take iron rich food preferably spinach beetroot a mutton spleen and all these things and vitamin c rich food for enhancing the iron absorption you need to include oranges bell peppers and uh, capsicum and number three you need to include anti-inflammatory foods because to reduce the cramps and bloating anti-inflammatory foods like because you will be having a lot of cramping and bloating turmeric ginger onion and garlic and hydration so drink more water in your menstrual phase the second phase is follicular phase this is where your uterine lining gets built up your estrogen hormones gets increased and this will support your egg development as well in this particular phase you need to take more protein rich foods and omega-3 rich foods because good fats and good protein are essential for egg quality and number three you need to include antioxidant rich foods like berries and carrots and all these things and number four B vitamins try including this especially more of um, mutton red meat chicken fish because non-vegetarian sources has higher levels of B vitamins to support your egg quality the third phase is ovulatory phase where the egg is being released and getting fertilized so this particular phase your body needs zinc rich foods especially more nuts and seeds and a lot of hydration obviously and you also need vitamin E rich foods so I've given all the list in uh, the description box so try to note all these things the fourth phase is none other than luteal phase where implantation is happening and your progesterone levels are rising so to support this particular phase you need to include magnesium rich foods and vitamin b6 magnesium like dark chocolate almonds bananas vitamin b6 rich foods like chickpeas and bananas and try taking these foods and don't forget complex carbohydrates such as quinoa and sweet potatoes these are very essential in your last phase so finally a well balanced phase wise diet can enhance the chances of getting conceived naturally so for women it's always a phase wise diet but for men they can take any foods anytime but it must be nutrient dense so if you need a fertility friendly diet according to your health concern please do check our fertility booster program I've given the link in description box and you can also enroll for couples fertility booster program if you have any couples related issues for both men and women that's all for today more fertility related content will be up in my channel do subscribe and for instagram link i've given a description box do follow namaskar